quite like that on earth before and i usually do remember everything do you really is that how we come to find ourselves a zillion miles away from home without enough lucy in the ship to get back are you implying that this minor inconvenience is my fault the rubbish minor we may be in big trouble we have to find the nearest lucy station i want the ship completely filled before we even try to find our earth friend Dee's house it would be so nice to see our friend Dee Dee again. It would be so nice to see our home planet again. I suppose you are right. Arguing won't solve anything. Shall we attempt to find a Lucy station? Woo! Hmm. Aren't we kind of tall for trick or treat? Well? Yes, I am, and thank you for asking. Right. There you go. Happy Halloween. Okay, I know you two are already here. I'm not going to forget those outfits in a hurry. Don't be greedy. Go pick on some other neighborhood. Perhaps we should simply go home. We cannot go home until we find some Lucy for the ship. Wee a dweezel. You guys are getting on my nerves. Now go bug somebody else. Terribly sorry, but you see we are in a bit of a spot. And we would be most grateful for some assistance. So please don't shut the door. At least until we can explain that we are Wookie from the planet you Wookie which is located somewhere in Alpha Centauri, although we are not so precisely where in Alpha Centauri, because my Mike 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 back up a little. Whew. That's not... Never mind. Now, who did you say you are? I don't believe we did say. How unforgivably rude of me. I am Mink, and I am Muffin, and, and we are Wookiees from the planet he Wolf, which is located sure, somewhere sure. in... Sure, sure. It's Chuck, isn't it? I thought that voice sounded familiar. Like get that silly head off you and... How'd you do that? Who are you guys anyway? And what is that thing? I am Mink. I could have sworn I just said that. And I am Muffin. That is an ethos, and we are working from the planet you work. Planet? Like, from outer space? Really? Oh, wow. At any rate, we don't mean to bother you, but could you tell us where we might find the nearest Luffy station? Nearest what? What's Luffy? I mean, I'd like to help and all, because if you're real alien life forms, oh, this is totally amazing. There is no word for Luffy on Earth. Weep a dweezel. We, we may have a little problem. Hey, why don't you just guys come in here, and I'll try and sort this out. Weep a on whatever did my door. This is serious. How could you possibly forget Lucy? You used the ship last. I assume you filled it with Lucy. Uh, what is Lucy? Lucy makes our spaceship go. You mean, it's fuel? Well, I suppose it is. But that's all I can tell you about it. There doesn't seem to be a word for it on Earth. But if the e talk can't find a word for it on Earth, then it must not exist. And we may never get home to the Wook. Oof, away, what? Come on. There must be something here that can fuel your ship. Is Luffy like propane? Or coal? 
Or what? Well, let me try again. What burns to make the ship go? Burn? Why would something burn? That would get awfully hot. Not to mention dangerous. No, no. That is how things travel in space. Something burns so that a force shooting in one direction pushes the object in the other direction. It's a basic law of nature. That sounds very interesting, but it doesn't have anything to do with our ship. Perhaps it is only a bylaw. Will you? Wait a sec. I did this science project on close motion with a friend of mine. We put all the stuff on the disc, and I bet she still got it. Let me go check. Just wait here. And don't open the door for anyone. my candy and your toast. Gee, Mickey, oh, I thought you decided you were too grown up for trick-or-treat. Whatever it is you're supposed to be, you look incredibly silly. I never thought I'd need to look at this force and motion stuff again, but I'm sure glad you saved it. What exactly do you need it for? These two aliens... It's this friend of mine. He was trying to tell me about some spaceship that didn't burn fuel. Right. What does he think they do? Launch it with a slingshot? Hey, wait a sec. My dad's program is still on there. And if that disc got mine... Don't worry. I'll just save it. I'll even print out a copy so that if anything did happen, we still have the stuff. What is it, anyhow? Something about his income tax, I think. He didn't seem too thrilled, so I didn't ask. Mickey, I still don't understand why you need the Force in Motion project. I mean, I had to explain absolutely everything to you. Don't rub it in. Besides, I don't need to understand the stuff. I just have to run the program. And I am the grade 7 computer genius, remember? And I am the grade 5 science genius, remember? Hey. Are you still mad because I said we're too old to trick-or-treat? I told you to go ahead if you want. I'm too old. But you're still... Don't you dare call me a little kid. Go ahead and play with the silly computer. I'm going to go upstairs and watch TV. Great. I can get Mink. I mean, there's a really good movie on Channel 5. All set. Now I'll get Mink and Muffin and... Hmm... And to stop the trick-or-treat crowd, I'll make like nobody's home. <laughs> 